All right, so it's been 185 days since I bought these two little red tail catfish. Been taking videos every day, posting them on YouTube so you can see how fast they grow. And I'm getting ready to do a water change. Today is water change day for these guys. And for water change, essentially what I do is I just drain it down about halfway and then refill it with water and then change the carbon in my filter. And once a week I've been doing water changes. And I'm going to start out with a little bit of hand feeding here. See if these guys will come up. Do a little bit of hand feeding. Still looks like they got plenty of room in this hot tub where they're still not outgrowing it. Let's see if I can get them to come up here. <laughs> they're a little bit sleepy. It's really early. The sun is just barely coming up. And... Uh, for me, this is the best time to feed them. All right, buddy, here you go. Oh, come on. <laughs> He's a little bit shy this morning. <laughs> you can smell it. You can smell it. Oh. I can't quite get them to hand feed. Interesting. A little bit bashful this morning. Uh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> All right. So we'll try maybe one more. Boy, I didn't chop out. Uh, usually I feed mostly hand feed cod because it stays together pretty good. But I kind of shredded it kind of fine. So we'll see if he'll take one more. One more hand feeding. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Come on, buddy. <laughs> the other one's like still sleeping over there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. We'll see here. Maybe. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> you got one little bit and then I dropped the rest. Wow. They seem a little bit sleepy this morning. Usually they're a little bit more spry than that. Maybe it's because we're coming up on a water change. Well, the other thing I kind of changed on this catfish hot tub, <laughs> I guess you could call it, catfish pond. Uh, I was doing uh, a lot more Melifix, the, the pond Melifix. I was dosing it like three times a week, and now I've pretty much cut back to where I'll just do one cap full of that, uh, the pond Melifix, right after a water change. And it was kind of funny because a lot of times I was getting foam building up on the top of the water and it seemed like uh, I wasn't getting any foam and it seemed like the fish were doing really good without the Melifix. So I don't know if it was maybe because I went away from the shrimp and I've been doing pretty much all fish, just three kinds of fish, but I've been only dosing that Melifix once a week and it's been working great. All right, so today I'm feeding the Triple Delight. This is cod, tilapia, and mahi-mahi that I got at the grocery store. All right, so I'm gonna finish up with some underwater video. Mm -hmm. 